<laughs> yes. Welcome. Hello, hello. Today's episode is going to be a little different. We've got only two contenders today, but they're kind of on the extreme opposite ends of the flavor spectrum. That's correct. That's correct. Our two contestants today are, first one, Warheads, Extreme Sour. It comes with assorted flavors, so yep. there's like, I think, four flavors? Four or five? There's, I see... I think it's at the back. Ooh. Okay, so we got black cherry, apple, lemon, watermelon, and blue raspberry. Ooh. It's been a while since I've had a warhead, but it's like just a regular warhead, not the extreme yeah. sour. It's been so long since I've had anything sour, this one's kind of making me nervous. All right, let's do it. It's got a sour meter. Did you <laughs> see that? Sour meter extreme. Sour meter. Woohoo! So personally, I'm not good with sour stuff. Um, my wife likes sour stuff like she can just bite at a melon, a, a, melon, a, a lemon, and have no reaction. It's like, oh, it's sour. Yeah. And then I bite it, I was like, just, just make that face. Pucker. <laughs> yeah, yeah. J just like, it's like my my whole face is uh, like imploding from the from, from, from the center. It's like, yeah. you yeah. know? Kind of like the day after when you eat the uh, Pocky One chip. <laughs> Your butt puckers like that. Okay, I think I will go with Apple. Oh, this one's connected. Oh, they're individually wrapped. Yes. Well, okay, we... blue raspberries. Okay. This is what I'm doing. You're not having all of them, right? I'm having one of each, sir. What? I'm having one of each, my friend. Well, you know what that means, right? I got one of each, too. Damn it. Why are you doing this to me? I don't have one each. This one's melted. Oh, is this oh, from that one? It's the okay, other half okay, of this I, one. I see, I see, I see. Okay, so you got a watermelon. Oh, you got one of each there too. Oh god. Yeah. I'm not looking forward to the lemon because I'm not a lemon person. No. Okay, what should we try first? We should try them together with the same flavor. Okay, let's do. Let's lemon? get the lemon out of the oh, way okay, first. Okay, good, good. I uh, think appreciate that. <sighs> Uh, my taste buds are you going. Suck. Yeah. Uh. You're already not liking this, are you? My mouth is just watering like you can't believe. Because I've had lots of sour before, and I know what's coming. Ready? Ready. On the hatch. <laughs> Oh. Ah, it's touching my tongue. It's like my tongue. <laughs> oh, that is, that is literally like eating a lemon raw. We're gonna do this four more times. Well, you know what? At, at least it's almost gone already. Like you, you just get it, that. Is that coating? That coating, it just goes, bam. But then it goes away quick. Yeah. It's like, oh, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, bye. <laughs> now it's like a sweet, subtle lemon. Yeah. Now it's just a regular lemon candy. So it's just gonna take a while. So, oh, you want to bite on it? Sorry, I can't bite on it. Oh, no. Can't bite. Um, well, what do you want? You just want to set it on top, or do you want a Ziploc, or do you want... Or just spit it out. Because we're going to be a while making this video. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Okay. Oh! 
Shrimp, there's a warning here. What? Where? Warning, eating multiple pieces within a short time period may cause a temporary irritation to sensitive tongues and mouths. Next. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, blue raspberry. We should we should almost have a contest. How many of these? We no, <laughs> no, that's a bad idea. How many you can eat one after the other before it's good you though. die? It's super good. Mm. Blue raspberry next. Blue raspberry next. Why am I having trouble? The wrapping is not that good. Wrapping's it... not that great. It's like really sticking to the candy. Oh god, my mouth is going haywire right now. Okay, there we go. I just want to show it, people. So that's the coating, right? That that white, weird, dry stuff. Yeah, that's the yeah. coating right there. It's not dry, it's sticky. Yeah, I guess it's sticky. The one that looks like mold. Ready, Freddy? <laughs> Ready. Pink. It's not as bad. Maybe because we had the first one. Mm -mm. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I spoiled it. <laughs> that is freaking sour. I was like swirling it a bit in my mouth, and I was like, that's a big mistake. Oh. 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 My mouth just wants to close right up and disappear. Wow. It's gone now. Oh, thank God they go away quick. Okay, now that the uh, sourness is pretty much gone, it kind of tastes like a blue Slurpee from 7-Eleven. Sure, sure. A little bit. Um, I wonder if you eat too much of this, because it's sour, right? Mm -hmm. Will it activate bowel movement? <laughs> right? No, I don't know. I guess there's one way to find out once we get to the last Yep, time will tell. Okay. Next one. What do you want? Black cherry. Black cherry. Okay. It's not bad. As soon as you get past that, it's like, oh, I made it. It's like the initial 30 seconds is just like... You're climbing it, the mountain. It's a short little hill. There you go, a hill, a hill. Yeah. Sounds like a great way. Uh, but the way to get up the hill is... Uh, <laughs> yeah, there's only one way. <laughs> Straight. What? It just sticks in there, hey? Oh my god. What? Yeah, it's, it's part of the inside of the packaging stuck onto the candy. Like, these things are <clears throat> flipping sticky. Uh, maybe um, people at the Warheads factory should maybe put a little coating on it so it doesn't stick so much. Can you imagine if this was not individually wrapped? It would just all be would, stuck in one ball. It'd be it'd be a hard ball yeah. of sour goodness. Just different flavors. All different flavors. It'd be like it looked like a popcorn ball, except it'd be like all these things stuck yeah. together. Down the hatch, buddy. Oh god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you doing this? <laughs> like right here, my muscle jaw, oh. my jaw muscles hurt. It's absolutely retracting. My God. It's a good thing we don't have sensitive tongues and mouths. Oh shit. I am. My tongue went numb for a little couple seconds there, I think. 
Wow. I don't know which is the worst one. This this one so far, black cherry for me has been the um, most sour out of the three I've tried. The blue one is, I think, the mildest. It went away pretty quick. Yeah. Yeah, this black cherry actually seemed to last uh, maybe like 40 seconds or something. I don't know. It does last longer for sure. Yeah. But, oh, that initial impact almost brought tears to my eyes. Wow. It would suck if it would just be sour the whole time. I, How can you enjoy that? I don't know. I, I probably spit it out after like a minute of just that constant, just boom, 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 yeah. boom, nonstop. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you right? I'm okay. I'm okay. You're okay? I don't know. I'm burping. Apple. Oh. Second last one, my friend. So glad. Yep. Oh, Gosh, this is like a rectangle. Holy crap. How big is yours? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Like, this is how sticky uh, this stuff is. Look at it. Why does it have to be that sticky? I'm having a hard time right now. You can just see that, just like, uh. Hey, no fair. It is like two in here, dude. <laughs> oh my lord. It's just stuck in the wrapper. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> Do you think a hard candy should, like, stick that much if you haven't licked it yet? I feel like a kid playing with a bunch of, uh... Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm only eating one, okay? <laughs> there, there, there was two in there, and you can see how sticky okay, it is. Okay, give me, give me one. I'll eat two, then. What? I'll eat two. Why? Just cuz. Okay, sounds good. Ready? Thing. You're crazy. Mmm. It's not that bad. Mmm. It's not that bad. Hmm. It's tolerable. Oh. Just. It sucks. But it's not as bad as the black cherry. Oh. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, it's it's not as bad. It it's kind of similar to the lemon one, where it's not it's not so powerful. It's more of that citrusy, like like you take a, a wedge of lime or lemon and that yeah. took maybe like ten seconds, and it just went away. Yeah, I think this is the least so far. There's one more to try. This is this is the least sour out of them all. Mm -mm. Nah. Okay. All right, Trent. Last oh. one. My oh God. God, my fingers are so sticky. I know mine too. That's okay. I'll uh, I'll wash the table. No problem. No problem at all. There. And watermelon. No, oh, I predict this the will be probably about similar to the green apple. You think so? That's my guess. Only one way to find out, right? Yep. If you can ever get it out of the package, you would find out. Yes. You get? Well, this one doesn't have nearly as much coating on it. I got on some it. coating on it. Well, yours is decent. Ready, Freddy? Yes. Oh, God. Ho, oh, oh. ho. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> 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 
This is like someone vomited in your mouth. Oh. You know what I mean? That, that, is, that acidic. That stomach bile sourness. It, oh. It's like, it's like there's a coating of battery acid on it. Yeah. But, okay, similar to the green apple, like 15, 15 seconds, gone. I, I'm still going. Still going? Mine's done. It, it, it's going out slowly. Wow. I just yeah, wanted mine, to go away. M mine had, I think I got a smidge of a dud because mine had very, looked like it had very little coating mm -hmm, on it. Mm -hmm. So, but don't get me wrong, that little bit of coating just went. Whoosh. I guess it varies via yeah. packaging. Well, it, it probably sticks to the packaging <laughs> too, hey? Yeah, and your fingers. Okay. So, okay, before we move on, yeah. what is the best flavor you like? Oh, would have, um, okay, the watermelon, the blue raspberry, and the green apple all had, once the, once the sourness went, they all had really good uh, flavors to them. The, the lemon... Yeah, it, it tasted like a regular lemon candy, not nothing out of the ordinary. The black cherry, to me, seemed to have the least amount of flavor after the sourness. But uh, it was the it, most potent. But it was the most, the sourest one, and it lasted the longest. So again, maybe that just came down to it had way more coating on it than the other ones. But My yeah. tongue's feeling numb right now. Yep. So on my end, I vote my favorite so far, regardless of how sour it is, I would say the blue raspberry. And then obviously the sourest for me as well is the black cherry. Um, worst flavor for me, just because I don't like lemon, would be the lemon. Uh, and yeah, that's it. Probably a runner up for best would be the green apple. Not because it didn't last long with the sourness, but because, I don't know, I just like green apple. Yeah. And it's still, the green apple had a really good green apple flavor. Yes. Not like a, a sour Granny Smith flavor, but yeah. like a good green apple candy flavor. If, if we were like blind taste tested, we would know what flavors it is, like for the green apple and the lemon. The the blue raspberry, uh, the watermelon, black cherry it might be a bit hazy. Yeah. Just because you know, like you have to physically see it and actually see what's written on it. Yeah. But yeah, very distinguishable for the uh, green apple for sure. Yeah. Okay, now that we've abused our mouths on the sour end of the spectrum, <laughs> we are moving on to our second contestant. Oh gosh. This is going the complete opposite direction. This is on the. Fairly uh, spicy side of things. I'm gonna get some water for this one. Yeah. Okay. So here it is. Watermelon flavored ghost pepper hard candy. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this bag has been previously opened. Um, I have not tried these. Uh, Chris tried it once quite a long time ago. Um, so we're gonna give this a go and uh, see how we do. So if the potency is not <clears throat> enough, we will probably try having two. But for now, I will try one. Here's a problem though. They're kind There's of bundled up together. So I guess I'm similar. having two. Okay, yep. And these are not individually They're wrapped. Like, They're kind of stuck together. But they are so stuck together. In similarly how these Candy stick to the inside of the packaging. These are sticking to each other. So, so I, I don't know. Like I think. Look at that. Yeah, they all like, crystallize. Oh, here, look. Here, here. There's a couple of individuals. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, get a good watermelon smell right off. Pretty sweet, hey? Yeah. Okay. You can just leave that down there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll leave that. Yeah, there. yeah, I'll just wash it off. Okay. Depends. If it's if it's good, I might just 
eat, eat, up eat all that. Nice. Okay, no problem. Ready, sir? <laughs> oh god. Let's try. Yeah. Uh oh. Definite, uh oh. Definite watermelon flavor. You uh, it's crawling. It's <coughs> it's it's a crawl. It's it's it, it, like like it's a crawling down my throat. Okay, I'm getting a little bit now. I can feel it at the back of my throat. Right, like it's still not. It's a slow crawl. Yeah. Okay, it almost seems like you have to um, let your saliva get through the first little layer. Or two yes, of candy. yes, yes, yes. Then you start developing. Wow, this is a tiny bit of a burn for me. I barely notice anything. Um, good tasting candy, though. For someone who's not a legend on spicy foods, it's not that bad. Yeah. But there is a burn. Like, it's a slow burn. Yeah. It'll, it'll go like this. I'm trying to distinguish, like, if it's going to stop. I don't think it's going to stop. It won't stop till after the candy's gone because the more, the more the saliva breaks down the candy, the more of the ghost pepper spiciness is um, coming out, leaching out of the candy. I think this is a good idea for like a road trip candy to mm. stay away kind of thing. The, yeah, this is one of those if you're if you're a pe uh, a spice head, you like having spicy stuff. And you just want a different kind of candy. This is a good candy. It'll it'll slowly come on. You'll notice it. You'll feel it grow all the way through there's none of this like boom high on here mm -hmm. it's a slow release um i like it you know what i think it needs to be not as sweet and mm. you get Whoops. more of the spice it's shoot that's all right okay sorry hmm. i'm getting a little bit more in this the spiciness in the middle mm-hmm it could. Does eating more feel more? No, it doesn't feel any. It's still the same. Still the same. Um, it covers your mouth a lot more. Yeah. Surface area wise. Like for for me, this has got um, the right mixture of just just a little sweetness, like a very mellow watermelon sweetness, and way more spiciness than sweet but for someone who's not so into spice you might maybe want a little more balance more um watermelon flavor and maybe may maybe keep the the heat the way it is it kind of feels like maybe a medium kind of spiciness yeah which a lot of people probably would handle with not too much problem but yeah, for most people, I think uh, they could definitely use more of the watermelon flavoring. For a regular person, I think it's like, ooh, spicy. I think this might be like a little bit under the threshold of most spice, yeah. spicy eaters. Yeah, it'll be on the, the lower end of the medium. Yeah, but, but for somebody who has never experienced like spicy, this might be a little bit, uh, a little bit too much, J just a yeah. tad bit. Yeah. Now keep in mind when people hear ghost pepper, they're like, wow, yeah. so flaming hot. Yeah. However, this, this uh, ghost pepper spiciness uh, has really been dumbed down for this particular oh, candy. Yeah. Uh, ghost pepper is normally way hotter than mm -hmm. this. Um, I think this has kind of been like a North Americanized or, or, or like spiciness. Huge batch extract. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Right on. Well, that's awesome journey. That's all. Good video. Yes, sir. Okay. Sayonara, everyone. We shall see you next time. Goodbye. Bye bye.